RNA polymerase II is an enzyme found in eukaryotic cells. It catalyzes the transcription of DNA to synthesize precursors of mRNA and most snRNA and microRNA. A 550K DAR complex of 12 subunits, RNAP2 is the most studied type of RNA polymerase. A wide range of transcription factors are required for it to bind to upstream gene promoters and begin transcription. Subunits, the eukaryotic core RNA polymerase II was first purified using transcription assays. The purified enzyme has typically 10 to 12 subunits and is incapable of specific promoter recognition. Many subunit-subunit interactions are known. DNA-directed RNA polymerase II subunit are PB1, an enzyme that in humans is encoded by the POLR2A gene and in yeast is encoded by a PO21. RPB1 is the largest subunit of RNA polymerase II. It contains a carboxy terminal domain composed of up to 52 heptapeptide repeats that are essential for polymerase activity. The CTD was first discovered in the laboratory of C.J. Ingalls at the University of Toronto and by J. L. Corden at Johns Hopkins University. In combination with several other polymerase subunits, the RPB1 subunit forms the DNA binding domain of the polymerase, a groove in which the DNA template is transcribed into RNA. It strongly interacts with RPB8. RPB2, the second largest subunit that in combination with at least two other polymerase subunits forms a structure within the polymerase that maintains contact in the active site of the enzyme between the DNA template and the newly synthesized RNA. RPB3, the third largest subunit, exists as a heterodimer with another polymerase subunit, POLR2J forming a core subassembly. RPB3 strongly interacts with RPB1-5, 7, 10-12. RNA polymerase II subunit B4, encoded by the POLR2D gene is the fourth largest subunit and may have a stress protective role. RPB5 in humans is encoded by the POLR2E gene. Two molecules of this subunit are present in each RNA polymerase to RPB5 strongly interacts with RPB1, RPB3, and RPB6. RPB6 forms a structure with at least two other subunits that stabilizes the transcribing polymerase on the DNA template. RPB7 encoded by POLR2G and may play a role in regulating polymerase function. RPB7 interacts strongly with RPB1 and RPB5. RPB8 interacts with subunits RPB1-3, 5, and 7. RPB9, the groove in which the DNA template is transcribed into RNA is composed of a PB9 and RPB1. RPB10, the product of gene POLR2L. It interacts with RPB1-3 and 5, and strongly with RPB3. RPB11, the RPB11 subunit is itself composed of three subunits in humans, POLR2J, POLR2J2, and POLR2J3. RPB12, also interacting with a PB3 is a PB12. Assembly, RPB3 is involved in RNA polymerase II assembly. A subcomplex of a PB2 and RPB3 appears soon after subunit synthesis. This complex subsequently interacts with RPB1, RPB3, RPB5, and RPB7 interact with themselves to form homodimers, and RPB3 and RPB5 together are able to contact all of the other RPB subunits, except a PB9. Only a PB1 strongly binds to a PB5. The RPB1 subunit also contacts a PB7, RPB10 and more weakly but most efficiently with a PB8. Once our PB1 enters the complex, other subunits such as our PB5 and our PB7 can enter, where a PB5 binds to a PB6 and our PB8 and our PB3 brings in a PB10, our PB11, and our PB12. Our PB4 and our PB9 may enter once most of the complex is assembled. Our PB4 forms a complex with a PB7. Kinetics, enzymes can catalyze up to several million reactions per second. Enzyme rates depend on solution conditions and substrate concentration. 
like other enzymes POLR2 has a saturation curve and a maximum velocity. It is a kilometer and a cat. The specificity constant is given by cat km. The theoretical maximum for the specificity constant is the diffusion limit of about 108 to 109, where every collision of the enzyme with its substrate results in catalysis. In yeast, mutation in the trigger loop domain of the largest subunit can change the kinetics of the enzyme. The turnover number for RNA polymerase 2 is 0.16 sa 1 subject to concentration. Bacterial RNA polymerase, a relative of RNA polymerase 2, switches between inactivated and activated states by translocating back and forth along the DNA. Concentrations of NTPEC equals 10 I 1 quarter MGTP, 10 I 1 quarter MUTP, 5 I 1 quarter MATP and 2.5 I 1 quarter MCTP, produce a mean elongation rate, turnover number, of 1 BPA1 for bacterial RNAP, a relative of RNA polymerase 2. RNA polymerase 2 is inhibited by I plus or minus amanitin and other amatoxins. Holoenzyme RNA polymerase 2 holoenzyme is a form of eukaryotic RNA polymerase 2 that is recruited to the promoters of protein coding genes in living cells. It consists of RNA polymerase 2, a subset of general transcription factors, and regulatory proteins known as SRB proteins. Part of the assembly of the holoenzyme is referred to as the pre-initiation complex, because its assembly takes place on the gene promoter before the initiation of transcription. The mediator complex acts as a bridge between RNA polymerase II and the transcription factors. Control by chromatin structure This is an outline of an example mechanism of yeast cells by which chromatin structure and histone post translational modification help regulate and record the transcription of genes by RNA polymerase II. This pathway gives examples of regulation at these points of transcription pre initiation, initiation, elongation. Please note that this refers to various stages of the process as regulatory steps. It has not been proven that they are used for regulation, but is very likely they are. RNA pol 2 elongation promoters can be summarized in three classes. Drug sequence dependent arrest affected factors, chromatin structure oriented factors, RNA pol 2 catalysis improving factors. Protein complexes involved. Chromatin structure oriented factors, HMTs, compass a radian per second uromethylates lysine 4 of histone H3. Set 2, methylates lysine 36 of histone H3. Interesting a relevant example, dot 1 a uromethylates lysine 79 of histone H3. Other, Bre 1, ubiquinates lysine 123 of histone H2B. Associated with pre initiation and allowing RNA pol 2 binding. Equals CTD of RNA polymerase equals, the C terminus of a PB1 is appended to form the C terminal domain. The carboxy terminal domain of RNA polymerase 2 typically consists of up to 52 repeats of the sequence to ser pro thr ser pro ser. The RNA polymerase CTD was discovered first in the laboratory of C. J. Ingalls at the University of Toronto and also in the laboratory of J. Corden at Johns Hopkins University during the processes of sequencing the DNA encoding the RPB1 subunit of RNA polymerase from yeast and mice respectively. Other proteins often bind the C-terminal domain of RNA polymerase in order to activate polymerase activity. It is the protein domain that is involved in the initiation of transcription, the capping of the RNA transcript, and attachment to the splissiosome for RNA splicing. See also, RNA polymerase I, RNA polymerase III, RNA polymerase II holoenzyme, post-transcriptional modification, transcription, eukaryotic transcription. References External links, more information at Berkeley National Lab. RNA polymerase 2 at the U.S. National Library of Medicine Medical Subject Headings